perimeter and area. Perimeter. Salma, will you come to the market with me to buy lace? Why? Why do you need lace? I have a handkerchief. I want to trim it with lace. Okay. So how much lace do you need? Oh yes. How much lace do I need? Okay. Let us take a spool of thread. Hold one end of the thread at one corner of the handkerchief. Then slowly unwind the thread along all four of its sides until you reach the first corner. Cut it there. You will know how much lace you need by the length of the thread you have cut off. Well, A, B, C, D is a square handkerchief. The sum of the length of sides AB, BC, CD and DA is the length of lace needed. This length is called the perimeter of the handkerchief. The perimeter of the square is the sum of the length of all four sides of the square. A fence of a single wire has to be put around a rectangular field. We have to find out the length of the wire needed. The sum of the lengths of all four sides of the rectangular field will tell us the length of wire needed. The perimeter of a rectangle is the sum of the length of all four sides of the rectangle. This is a triangle made of wire. To find out the length of the wire needed to make it, we will straighten out the wire and measure its length. This length will be the sum of the lengths of the three sides of the triangle. The perimeter of a triangle is the sum of the lengths of all three sides of the triangle. This figure shows a rectangle whose sides are 3 cm, 2 cm, 3 cm, and 2 cm. Let us find out its perimeter. The perimeter of a rectangle is the sum of the lengths of all four of its sides. So it is 3 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2 which is equal to 10. Therefore the perimeter of the rectangle is 10 cm. The figure alongside is a square and all its sides are 2 cm long. Let us find the perimeter of the square. The perimeter of a square is the sum of the length of its four sides. So it is 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 which is equal to 8. Therefore the perimeter of the square is 8 cm. This is a triangle. The sides of the triangle here are 4 cm, 5 cm and 6 cm long. Let us find out the perimeter of the triangle. The perimeter of a triangle is the sum of the length of all three of its sides. So it is 4 plus 5 plus 6 is equal to 15. Therefore the perimeter of this triangle is 15 cm. Exercise number 1. Find the perimeter of the figures given below. Number 1. It is a rectangle. The rectangle has sides of 1 cm, 4 cm, 1 cm and 4 cm. Now the perimeter is equal to sum of all the four sides of rectangle. So it is 1 plus 4 plus 1 plus 4 which is equal to 10 cm. So perimeter is equal to 10 cm. Number 2. It is a square and all of its sides are 3 cm long. Now the perimeter of a square is the sum of the length of its four sides. So it is 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 which is equal to 12 cm. So perimeter is equal to 12 cm. Next is a triangle whose sides are 5 cm, 4 cm, 3 cm. The perimeter of a triangle is sum of the length of all three sides. So it is 5 plus 4 plus 3 which is equal to 12 cm. So perimeter of the triangle is 12 cm. 
Next is a rectangle again with side 7 cm, 2 cm, 7 cm and 2 cm. The perimeter of a rectangle is the sum of the length of all its four sides. Which means it is 7 plus 2 plus 7 plus 2. Which is equal to 18 cm. So perimeter is equal to 18 cm. Last is a rectangle. This is also a rectangle. This rectangle has sides 3 cm. 4 cm, 3 cm and 4 cm. So the perimeter is sum of all the sides of rectangle which means 3 plus 4 plus 3 plus 4 that is equal to 14 cm. Number 2. The sides of a rectangular field are 150 meters, 120 meters 150 meters and 120 meters. Find the perimeter of the field. The rectangular field has sides 150 meters, 120 meters, 150 meters, 120 meters. Now, perimeter of a rectangular field would be sum of all the four sides. So, it would be 150 plus 120, plus 150, plus 120, which is equal to 540 meters. So, the perimeter of the rectangular field is 540 meters. Subscribe to my channel. Click on bell icon to get notification about new videos.